Suba Environmental Education of Kenya, or SEEK. The Nyanza province has the highest HIV AIDS prevalence rate in Kenya. The child mortality rate is 206 deaths per 1,000 births. It has the lowest life expectancy rate in Kenya, which is 46 years, and it is the poorest province in Kenya. In the greater Suba district, the HIV AIDS prevalence is 26%. One fourth of its 210,000 people are orphaned children. The life expectance is only 37 years, and the rate of unemployment is 40%. This is compounded by the fact that because of pollution and poor fishing practices, Lake Victoria, the source of much of the area's food, water, and jobs, could be completely depleted of fish as early as 2014, experts warn. This would be catastrophic to an area already in great need. SEEK is led by Don and Nancy Richards. Don is a former game warden and native of South Africa. His team provides education for Kenyans on the science behind biosystems that will bring positive change to both the environment and community. One such example of the training provided by SEEK is a multi-story garden. This biosystem takes up very little space near a home but will adequately supply vegetables for the family. Other examples of tools that will help with health, poverty and hunger are solar cookers which eliminate the need for charcoal which is the primary cause of deforestation in the area or sun stoves or composting toilets to only name a few tippy taps are a simple example of the resourceful style that seek uses to help families in the surrounding areas with no running water a 2.5 liter plastic container is configured with minimal supplies to serve as an adequate hand washing source in addition to providing the surrounding communities with education and tools to better health, hunger, and local ecosystems in the Lake Victoria area, this faith-based organization provides camps for children, stressing God's love, an individual's worth, and an individual's responsibility to both the environment and oneself. In beautiful art form, the Children's Museum displays imagery of the world while stressing personal responsibility for the care of God's creation. This sense of personal responsibility is also applied to sanitation practices that will both keep the child healthy and help prevent the spread of disease.